A troubling national trend of federal postal employees accosting, assaulting, and impeding the public's First Amendment protected right to know what our government is doing on our behalf and at our expense continues. Despite the fact that in the year 2016, it is common knowledge that photographing and video recording federal buildings, as well as federal employees, is a completely lawful activity. How you doing? Good, how are you? Can I help you with something? No, thank you. I'm good. No, thanks. I'm fine. Huh? No, thank you. I'm fine. Why are we taking pictures of it? I'm just getting some B-roll footage. That's all. B-roll footage. I'm sorry? Just getting some video of the trucks coming in and out, that's all. Why is that? Uh, who are you? I am the TANS manager for the NDC Postal Service. Who are you? Uh, <laughs> I'd rather not say, actually, so. Why not? Because it's none of your business, really. Well, it actually is because you're taking photos of my operation. Okay. Is, that, is there something wrong with that? I have an issue with that. Why? Because you won't tell me why you're doing it. Uh, like I said, I'm just getting B-roll footage for a story I'm working on. So. Or... Beyond that, it's none of your business. I, I'll explain to you. I'm going to B-roll footage for a story I'm working on, and beyond that, it's, it's none of your business, okay. to be honest I'll just have the sheriff's office come check it out then. For what? Because uh, you're taking photos where you're not supposed to take photos of. I, what do you mean by that? Is there like a, a law or something that says I can't take photos? Well, we'll find out. I'll just have JSO come out here. You guys aren't doing no anything wrong, are you? No. I mean, so why are you acting so suspicious? Well, why are you acting so suspicious? Uh, I mean, you're the one that doesn't want to be on, your operations being on camera. It's almost like as if you're doing something wrong or you got something to hide. No, my policy says we don't take photos within the postal facility. Am I within the postal facility? You're taking pictures of photos in my facility. That's right, I am. Yeah. That's exactly what I'm doing. Yeah, I'll take that. You can not tell me what you're here for. I told you what I'm here for. I'm getting B-roll footage for a story that I'm working on. As a matter of fact, that's what I'm looking for right there. So you're the manager, the NDC manager? No, it's not your business. <laughs> Actually, it is. If you're if you're coming out to me and you work for the post office, are you a federal employee? Yes, I am. Okay, then it is my business. Why is it your business? Because you're coming out here and telling me I can't do something that's constitutionally protected. Well, we'll see about that, won't we? Yeah, I guess so. It'll be here shortly. Who? Who's that? Police. You have to have my permission to do that. Really? I do? And what law are you citing? Privacy Act. Oh, the Privacy Act. And you're a federal employee, right? You're a federal employee. You've come out here and approached me on a public sidewalk telling me I can't do something that's publicly, that's a First Amendment protected right. You understand you're taking pictures of federal vehicles and property? Absolutely, yes. It's a matter of public interest. When JSO gets here and they tell you that what I'm doing is perfectly fine, it is constitutionally protected activity, are you guys going to learn your lesson? Are you going to are you going to are you going to continue to harass photographers for doing constitutionally protected activity? So when I get here and they tell you it's it's perfectly legal, hopefully you'll learn your lesson. You won't come out here on your bike. You won't tell me not to do something that it's, I'm perfectly had the right to do, right? Especially since you're the manager. Is that right? Okay. And you're also blocking the entrance, creating a safety hazard. I don't think these drivers that are coming out can see past your truck, sir. It's a safety hazard. Just seriously, though, that's a safety hazard. If you would just move your truck out of the way so we don't cause an accident. I'm going to walk on down there and get some videos down there. Hopefully you guys will move your vehicle so you quit creating the safety hazard. I don't want you to be responsible for causing an accident. About 20 minutes later, the postal manager and the trailer spotter departed without another word. To the best of my knowledge, the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office didn't even bother to respond.